guys, what's going on? Crusader here, back on more Monster Hunter World. Last episode, we went into a brand new area, the Coral Highlands. Kind of sporting a new weapon here from our flaming T-Rex. Real pain in the butt. This is what he is. But I figured I'd start us really pretty quickly here as far as like not having to sit in the loading screen too long. I do, however, need to make up some extra st Okay, I can't make up anything at the moment. Never mind. Yeah, we should be alright. So this episode we are going to be doing our balloon operation. It's kind of bizarre sounding, I know. No, put that away. Just hop down and. I should have just freaking killed myself there. On top of that, as well as in the previous episode, I went through a good majority of places on the map. Now, the. Uh, the animal that we're, or well, it's not really an animal. It's more of a monster. Hop down. What are you doing? Thank you. Monster that we're happening going after in this episode. I have killed one before, and it's this really weird rat thing. It's the best I can... It's a weird rat thing. It's the best I can really describe it. Where luck is because I happen to... Go through and get quite a few... Research points on it. So we know it's weakness. It doesn't like fire very much. Just trying to track it down here as far as where on the map it's at because it's not popping up. Ah, dang it. So, it typically likes to hang out in the upper north region. Ooh, coral bone. Ooh, two coral bones. through here at least presumably I can get closer to my maybe not it's gonna hop us up to the uh, the north encampment here because it likes hanging out around here I don't know why but it likes doing that. And I have killed one before, plus the thing that keeps popping up is our local snow dragon. Going to continue to gather up as much information as possibly can on all of them. Not quite on farm yet. Uh, well, in fact, not at all. Just got to keep an eye out for tracks for what the heck we are looking for here. Oh, there we go. That's what I need. No. That's for our electric raptor friend. Don't need stuff for that. Ooh, bone pile. Take as much coral bone as we can get. Okay. There she be. So the weapon that we're using right now came from our ever so famous uh Ooh. Uh 
fire TRX like I had mentioned earlier. It gives me a great advantage against this thing. I don't want SOS flares, I want to blow this thing up. Just like that. Get in as much damage as possible. What the heck I'm doing? I need to switch my flame ammo. Pull it back over here. Ouch. Stop screaming at me. It, it, it's like a mix between a rat that has like white fur owl. So he's not too bad to take down really. Ooh, 13 damage. And then he does this thing where he does it really weird. That's new. He'll do this really weird ground pound thing with his tail. Yeah, there it is. Reload here. Oh, hey. Over here, buddy. Thank you. Ha 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 ha! 78 damage. Oh, that is beautiful damage. Just ouch. Get a mega potion drink here before I end up getting myself killed. Really don't want to faint for go through here. Stop doing that. Ooh, too close. Right away. Drink up. Alright, so he's out of balloon form. Which is kind of unfortunate. Ooh, we're out of regular flame. Well, we picked up some, some fire herbs. We'll be alright. Alright, now he's going to take off on me. Where do you think you're going to go? We'll give him a minute just to get his bearings. And in the meantime, we're going to craft some more flame ammo. Ooh, we can do Trank now. Ah. I've never used this before. Used to capture monsters ensnared in traps. Okay, so that'll be for some of our side mission stuff for later. Oh, my pouch is full. I've got sticky ammo that I can use. Spread ammo 3 is not something I'm wanting to use currently. So we're going to get rid of that for now. I can make some later. Okay. So you're not very far away, which is kind of dumb for you to be doing oh well speaking of dumb let's heal completely before we go and take it on and like all new monsters that we hunt down it gives us a brand new armor set on top of oh, okay good I'll go right into that oh no you don't Ooh. Hey, ugly, over here. Come on, I know you want to. Oh. There we go. No, 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 bring it back over here first. Come on. Come on, we want to kill this thing. There we go. Get some serious damage in. Over here, come on. Come on, I want to get some more damage in on you before my mines disappear. Oh, that's kind of good, actually. 
we can get even more damage. Where'd you go? There you are. Come on. Come on. Ah. Well, it's nice to know we can eat again. Come on, Percy. Get him. Get him. Just don't want to get ooh, hit by that and then get hit off the edge. Had that happen one too many times already. Okay, good. It's back on the ground. Well, the mine got used up. That's not a big deal. Come on, come on. Oh, you know what? I forgot to put a voucher on this. I completely forgot to do that. Get even more stuff off this thing. Reload. Come over here. There we go. Get some damage. Ay, ay, ay. That hurt me a lot. And the nice thing is that Prissy is now proficient. She reached maximum level with the uh, with the healing spray. So we're starting to get some stuff broken on it. Whenever it starts looking burned like that, that's typically a good sign for me. Yay! Not good, not good, not good, not good. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Get. Oh. Whoa. Uh, no, we're going to use this as a very good time to do that. Ow! heal again so I don't get slapped up and clapped up. There it is. So it didn't run. Kind of surprised. Five damage, I'll take that. It's pretty hurt. That should be blown out as best that should be blowing up anytime soon. I don't know if I hit I don't think I hit it. No, it's running away. Let's see where it's gonna run. If it runs towards its nest, perfect. That makes quite nice for me. Where are you gonna go? Ah, I didn't want to waste the f mine. Let's see where it's gonna go. Let's see how fast we can get to it. Oh, is you going to your nest already? Actually, no. We don't have to fast travel anywhere. This could potentially be the end already. We're barely even into the episode. No, no, back off, go away. Yeah, I think it already went to its nest. <clears throat> Which is great news. Ooh. This is even better news right here. Got some more fire herbs running. Yeah, I think it's up at its nest resting, so that's perfect. Now I'm just gonna go in there and just completely annihilate it with flame shot and more of our uh, 
mines built up. If I can get to it fast enough. Well, not necessarily fast enough, but slow enough, I should say. And, yep, it went to its nest. Final showdown. Ooh, and we got three mines. So it can get triple the amount of damage in on this thing. So what I did when I first killed this thing is when it got here, I gillied up, brought this out, just did it in one spot with all three, aimed, and freaking fired. Got more parts broken. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, it's really angry right now. Ah, where are you going? No, stay. Damn it. Why did I do that? I was really hoping that I would have stayed there. Wait, where is it? Are you, yes, you're back. Why are you back? I mean, I, I'm not complaining or nothing, but usually when you fly away, you fly a fly away. Come on. Oh, there goes our, well, one mine at least. We can plant one new one right here and just wait for it to land. Come on. There we go. Now that I have a better understanding of how to use the mines. Oh, there goes another one. I need to do this, and I need to heal really fast. Ow! What the hell was that? That's not even... Oh, that's really bad. Come on, slap yourself. There we go. Give me some sticky ammo here. This might do the trick, maybe. Yeah, 25 percent. 25 damage, not too bad, and that's for just one shot. Low up. Ah, oh, and you go right back into flying mode. Ooh, but we brought you down. Get another one in this bitch. Are you glitched? Oh, no, you're not glitched. Nice there we go. Let's hurry back to the research base. I'm not bad. Took down another one. See what it gives me this time around. Give me a bunch of its uh, wing and brain last time. Got the pelt out of it. Got the scale. And another scale. I'll take that. It's not too bad at all. What's this? What else did you drop? Oh, wow. Wavering tear. I wonder what we can use that for. We're going to be heading back here in a few minutes. So I got another 10 seconds to go. Just collect some random odds and ends here. That went over a lot smoother. <coughs> Plenty of time to be able to give our Waver and friend here a chance to run. 
Also, we're getting more scales, maybe? Yeah, we're getting more scales. It's not bad at all. A cutscene has been added. Eh, don't need it. So we're going to run up to the smithy. Well, actually, I need to go over to the ecologist first. And update our stuff for our monster field guide. Oh, wait, let's see what the fleet master's got to say first. <laughs> Balloons are all over to the airship is ready. All thanks to you and the airship engineer. We completed preparations on our side as well. We can depart whenever you are ready. However, I do have one thing worth mentioning. What? We never bothered to test fly. Oh, so we're the guinea pigs. That's great. It's not going to be a problem for you, is it? it yes. <laughs> when you're ready, just say the word and we'll make her descent into the rotten veil. Yeah, don't worry, I plan to. Can't get a login bonus here. Not too well done stakes. That reminds me, I gotta go see if I can um, snag up some barbecue spits. Because I'm completely out of them as far as I'm aware. So we're gonna run back. We're not going on an expedition, we're going back to Astara. Gonna hit up the workshop to see what see if the parts that were dropped off of the um, balloon rat that's what I'm gonna call it it's the, it's the balloon rat see if it opened up anything new as far as our weapons upgrades are concerned if not that's okay because I know the armor is pretty in depth when it comes to the material needed for it. Let's double check there here. So Fiber, how do you like the new hunting ground? Things have gotten interesting around here. The fissure in the ravine has allowed us to bring a steady supply of materials for the far side of the... well, I would hope so. I'm working on integrating those materials in our offering at the smithy. Have a look at the upgrade branch of your weapons. Oh, cool! So we have a new branch, several in fact, wow. So this is our eel friend. That's the one that is water based. Oh. Okay. So we're current, well, we're right here up, up up top, but this one down here, you go over one for rarity five, you get an additional slot. And it's the same for up here. But we haven't discovered what the hell is going on. Barath tree. Yeah, we don't know anything yet. And really what I've been told by a couple of buddies of mine who are way further than I am, they keep telling me just keep playing you will eventually unlock stuff so that's what we're gonna have to do oh, no and that's the one that we're currently working with no no that's thunder that is thunder blitz Now I wonder, I'm going to check into our armor really quick. No, nothing's opened up on it yet. Nothing, nothing. That's really disappointing. Yeah, so this is the stuff that you can make from our little balloon rat that we just took down.
and it's up to 20 on the rarity or on the on the defense and that's just base but you get negative to fire and if I go back out after our um, uh, what is he I can't remember his name off the top of my head if we go back out after our flaming t-rex guy he'll obliterate us But if we do this guy, I don't know. I'm thinking we can make the ingot armor. And we're only negative two on that, but we got better defense against our electric squirrel friend. We're just missing a bunch of uh, coral crystal. But I do want to make the legs to kind of flesh it out a little bit more. It's almost fashion. There we go. Oh, that's cool. So we can actually get a preview of what things look like if we went and made them. So that's from our ice dragon friend, which I might go out and kill just for that. Evade window airborne. I have no idea what the heck that is. Ice attack. That's what that looks like, but it... I don't know. That looks a little bit weird. At least to me. I would, I would keep this. But I like that armor. We might actually go and farm for that. He's not quite on farm, like I said. Not quite. Easy doozy to get a, hold, get a handle on. And charms. This opened up... After I came back... Uh, charms give you an additional boost when it comes up to additional things. So, like you got attack charms here that boost your attack skills, defense, and your resistances. Evasion, which I imagine evasion is mostly meant for using to increase your dodge roll. I'll look into it. That's what all the charms are for. Fortify skills. Yeah, it's not too bad. Alright guys, I'm going to call it an episode there. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it was a little bit short, but I didn't expect to take down our balloon rat that fast. Got a little bit RNG on that. Although I'm very happy with it. But until next time, guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for me. Don't forget to hit that bell to know when we're coming back out for more Monster Hunter. And as always, guys, have a good one.